fucking ingenious. Hell yeah! Welcome to another episode of Movement Madness, everybody. I'll be your host, as always, Eric Harrison, and today on the show we're going to talk about Judd Apatow's latest directorial effort, This is 40. So what do you think? Should we have sex tonight? Ugh. Sounds awful. I'm just really constipated. Do you really want to? Well, now. What are you doing? I need you to look at something in my butt. I do not want to investigate your anus. Some people think they're always right. You can't watch Lost, got it? You let an eight-year-old watch South Park. That's a cartoon. Yeah, with dicks in it. We're losing money at the store. We can't fire Desi. She's our best salesperson. Hi. I don't think she's wearing underwear. It's all dark up there. Well, maybe she's wearing dark underwear. Yeah. Maybe her underwear has a picture of a vagina on it. Let me start by saying I'm actually a big Judd Apatow fan. I like all the movies he's directed. I like all the movies he produces. I like that style of comedy. I, I, I dig it. it. It's right up my alley, as they say. Not in a, not in a gay way. No homo. With that said, I... It was really hard to get into This Is 40. First of all, it was way too long. Way too damn long of a movie. Um, let me just say first off that I'm not 40, I'm not married, and I have no kids. That could factor into why I didn't enjoy this movie very much. But uh, like I said, it's too long. It took a long time for me to even kind of get into what was going on. And even then, even when I got into it a little bit, it didn't really capture me completely. Honestly, it felt like they wrote about 60% of the script and said, you know, we'll just improvise the rest on the day of the shoot. Which is something an Apatow film is known for, you know, and something I like about the movies, typically. But in the, in the past, in all the movies from his, his past, I felt like the improvisation was edited into the movie very well. Seriously, no joke, this time it felt like they had half a script and they just said, we'll just make up the rest of it as we go along. And it don't work here. With that being said, I guess that means I really can't recommend This is 40. Unless you're 40 and you're married and you got kids and you think maybe you'll identify with the movie, go ahead and check it out. Everyone else, just watch one of Apatow's other films and you know what? Best of luck next time, buddy. He loves you because you're the fighter. One person in a relationship's got a punch. You told her that she used Viagra? Come on. That's the last thing you do. I think it's on the warning label. You want that to go to waste? Looks like a plant trying to reach the sun. I'll do it for 10 minutes, but you have to figure out what to do with the other four hours. This is 40. So that's the show. Tune in next time. We'll do more movie reviews. As always, I'm out. Peace.